I've been working with rough sleepers and, and, and people in the, in the area where my wife and, and I and my family live. And so I got the idea that I actually wanted to do something in terms of building refuge accommodation for them. And so when I started to sp actually speak with people that you know had been through homelessness, etc., and it became apparent to me that Refuges are great as temporary solutions, but they're not actually a place to call home. And so that was the missing part or the important part, like the cry of you know, people's hearts was to have somewhere to call home. The idea with tiny homes is to provide somewhere small and affordable just for a single person or for a couple to live self-sufficiently and sustainably. The homes are set out in a linear way with all the common facilities in the middle of the site and common facilities are things like laundry and meeting spaces and just things that everyone can use and the idea is that they all come to the middle to use those facilities together. Because you're sharing a washing machine or you're sharing tools or, or a, a meeting area, uh, because it's shared you have to cooperate, you have to learn how to take turns. So again it's a great opportunity to meet and to develop relationships with other people. The aspiration with all architects you want to you want your designs to really help people and I think that this one is a real example of you know something you can do that actually really affects the people's lives and I think that's why it really appealed to me as a project. One of our hopes is that this will not only um, sort of us doing our own projects but that other people will take an interest in it and think maybe hey I could do that as well and so we've set up um, through our website a replicator program and so really anybody who has like just a desire and a passion and the capability and the stickability to actually like see it through then we encourage them to contact us and work through our replicator program because again it's not about us owning it it's about us coming together as a nation and uh, my, my dream, and you know, some people just would think that this is crazy, but I actually think that we can be the first country in the world that actually solves um, homelessness in, in, in a practical and a great way. Because it's such a pioneering project, um, it opens the door, I think, nationally to uh, use this as an approach to solve homelessness. At least one, one more option that we have to, to solve the problem. What we're doing is not actually even really about building you know, houses and structures. It's actually about changing people's lives. And so, you know, like the greatest joy for me and for my whole team and, and, and all of our collaborative partners, I believe, is that actually seeing the difference that it makes in people's lives. I coined a, a saying early on, you know, that it's, it's, it's a housing first strategy, but it's not just about a house, it's actually about creating a home so it's a springboard for people, and by that, to actually springboard them into a better life.